Oh my god, it is so hot today. I'm literally sitting with an ice block in my lap. What could be the cause? Well, hello there, Frederick. Oh my, well, aren't you just the cause of raw, excruciating hotness? My god, you're the fault I'm sitting here sweating like a po. And good evening. Laris, Lars, and Lars, and welcome to the click. I do hope you're having an amazing day because you deserve it. Today we're gonna do something beautiful. Oh my god, isn't it amazing? I love beautiful things. We're gonna look at r slash frick you in particular, which is obviously very particular specific stories about the universe saying frick you to specific people. And we're just gonna sit here and be glad that it isn't us. Enjoy. The Independent. Elephant kills 70 year old and then returns to trample her corpse at funeral in India. How did you even figure out where the funeral was? This is so weird. Oh my god, is this a stalker elephant? This is kind of creepy. This seems like the premise to some kind of creepy pasta story. Oh yeah, I love concerts. Wait, what is that light doing? Oh my god, that's the worst seat in the world. <laughs> and it doesn't get better. Oh my god. Even when the light so changes, that light is still... No, no, I'm gonna glow on this exact dude. He paid for this. That's like the wildest thing. These seats are probably very expensive. 199 right-handed screwdriver. 399 left-handed screwdriver. But they're the same. Can I still drive buy the other one? But Oh my god, it's so hot. I'm just gonna sit and hug my ice cube instead. Check this out. Oh. Darn you leftists! That's not really what you thought it meant, but we can interpret it however we want. Why doesn't Facebook accept videos over 26 seconds? Thanks! To prevent Ford owners from posting their quarter mile race videos. <laughs> It's such a bird. Poor Ford owners. Oh my god. Take that, Borb. <laughs> Welcome. All colors, all sexes, all orientations, all religions, all cultures, all abilities, all ages, all sizes, except the Danish. Love lives here. <sighs> yes, indeed. What orientation are you? Danish, you get out of here. We are accepting, but we have limits. What if mayonnaise came in cans? That would suck because you can't microwave metal. Good morning to everyone except these two people. Hear me out fam, hear me out fam. Boiling mayonnaise soup. So it's just mayonnaise and a bit of water, so it's a bit more less thick than usual. You boil that bad boy and you're going straight to hell. So we got, oh, it's 500 kronor. <laughs> Why are they Swedish? This is embarrassing. <laughs> Nej! Nej! Inte min 500 kronor sedel! Oh, this is what you would expect if Blizzard made Diablo Immortal into a car. Oh, you wanna speed up above 30? Please insert 50 bucks. <laughs> Thank you! You wanna turn on the radio? Just two dollars and you can do that. Everything in the car is like a paid one-time use DLC. Ah, uh, what a glorious future. That's gonna be some Black Mirror stuff. It's like, please insert five cents to break the car. Oh, I'm broke! There we go. Worst episode ever. This is the only rule for r slash soda. r slash soda. No post by you slash blueberry axolotl. He's prohibited from posting. <laughs> That's the only... But, but <laughs> Did you make a subreddit just have a rule against one person? I feel like this could definitely be a direction my own subreddit takes in the future. r slash to click a oh, woe. Ignore that last part, that's nothing to do with anything. Uh, everyone is allowed to post except click. Oh, whoa. So you know when you try to park your car in the shade so it doesn't get fried in the summer and there you go. Take that. <laughs> Stupid car. I saw a Belgian man today. I am sorry you had to go through that. I am praying for you, Anon. It's so traumatizing, darn Belgians. If I have any Belgians watching... Yeah, look next to me, baby. Here is the shirt! I can't read that. Okay, come on, okay. I know how to crack this. We've done this before. Hell yeah, baby, let's do this. Woo! -hoo. So here we go, how to fix uh, color blindness in Photoshop. So we just make a little layer with this po. We go into frickin' adjustments and hue saturation. I'm gonna change the hue. <gasps> what the frick is this? Look! Color blind! People suck! That's outrageous! Oh my god, I didn't go on the internet today to be ableistically discriminate. Wouldn't it be funny if it actually said something else? If, if it's like a trick, it's like, oh, that's the obvious text, and it has another text that, like, <laughs> has a different hue. So even when you fix it, it's still hidden. Don't do this. Don't get any ideas. My god, I can see my own subreddit just blowing up in the next 24 hours. Sheesh. This guy was edited out of the Shining's iconic ending photo. 
He's just vibing and no, no, screw you. Is this based on a real photo? Or is this something they've only taken for, you know, the movie itself? I'm like genuinely intrigued. I wonder which one it is, if they took an historical actual photo or if it's just staged. If it's an actual photo, then it's really a frick you moment. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna put this little thing on my fancy desk. Nope, denied, human. <laughs> well, you can always try to put it back, but no, no, denied. <gasps> Uh, try to put it back again. Oh, yes, indeed. Yeah, it sits very nicely there. <laughs> what a shame. What a silly carbon being you are. Pa damn! <laughs> oh, oh. I am severely entertained and very glad this is not happening to me. The question was basically, what would you do if God gave you his powers? World peace except in Switzerland. Switzerland is the PvP zone. I, I played on a DayC server back in the day that was like this. It had like one town that was a safe region, where everyone went and traded and vibed, and then everything else was a PvP zone. It's like that, but inversed. You know, humans are pretty violent and we need an outlet for it anyway, so w which one should be a PvP arena? Switzerland. It's gonna be fine. Archaeologists working at the ancient Roman city of Pompeii, Italy, uncovered the remains of a 30-year-old man who appeared to have survived the initial eruption of Vesuvius in 79 AD, only to be killed when he was struck by a large slab of stone. Boink! <laughs> That's so sad! Can you imagine? Yay! I made it! I was the fastest runner in the village! Booyah, baby! <laughs> Too bad. You might say that it really rocked his world. Ha <laughs> ha ha! Well, his destiny was really written in stone. <laughs> I'm so good at this. Oh, I love myself. Zero sugar, squeezed lemon flavor, and other natural flavors. It tastes just like what you get at the lemonade stand, only with zero sugar and 11 key vitamins and minerals. Except it's not handed by some pint sized entrepreneur who most certainly didn't wash their hands properly. And not to be nitpicky, but leaving lemonade in the sun with no lid? Yikes. Other than that, it's just like you get at the lemonade stand, except it doesn't suck. Who hurt you? Which, like, lemonade elementary school kids hurt you? Oh <laughs> my god, I want to know the story leading up to this. <gasps> oh my god. About as magic as your dad, mate. <laughs> and he disappeared, didn't he? Hey! Hey! <laughs> Oh my god. When your like autopilot brain just has this beautiful serve and you don't realize you're literally smacking like a 10 year old kid. <laughs> oh my god. I mean the comeback was really good, but it's it's so over the top. Oh no. B sober took the car next to mine during the 10 minutes I was in the store. <laughs> That's when someone parks parallel over two spots. So you just smear their car in honey and just watch the fireworks. Frick this toilet in particular. So we have a little sappy lightning as lightning does. It came through the roof and smacked right on top of this very particular toilet. It didn't even go through the pipes or anything. Just straight through the roof. God knows how many floors. And just there you go. World's unluckiest toilet. Laddie coming to my car in the parking lot. Oh, what is this? Cash for junk cars. <laughs> Did you just call my car junk? That's not very nice. What a sales pitch. Hey, good sir, this piece of property you have. Oh my god, that really sucks for a very affordable fee. I can take it off your hands. I will frick who likes this comment. You should like your own comments. You could go frick yourself. Oh, carefully, he's a hero. <coughs> One plus. After our own. Uh-huh. Hello, all you dark mode users. That is sneaky. I like that. Light mode users, what's wrong with you? Tell me, okay, tell me in the comments. I want to see a war zone in the comments. How many of you use dark mode versus light mode? And why are you using light mode? It's, it's sickening. It burns your eyes. Are you just masochists? So anyway, I respect everyone's opinion. Moving on. Imagine having the naughties and he says, say my name, baby, but his name is Gilbert. Frick this tweet. <laughs> Oh, yes, Gilbert. Mm. This rolls off the tongue, doesn't it? Just like other things would. Hey, that was, that was, that was a joke. Oh my god, we got some of them kicked balls, eh? I love myself some kicky balls. Oh, right in the balls. All right in the balls again. All right, he's still blocking the ball. What a champion. And right in the balls again. <laughs> oh. Oh, this is just neutering by a third ball. This is horrible. Oh, frick you. What did the person who owns this car do to be subjected to this? And what kind of person does this? What even is, is that blood? No, it's paint, right? It must be paint. Is this some kind of Halloween prank? Oh, foxes keep attacking this 88-year-old Mainer. I wish I knew why, he says. <laughs> what do you mean? 
Foxes, how many times has this happened? It must happen at least three times for this headline to be made. That is wild. Scientists have discovered that on occasion, an octopus will punch a fish for no reason other than spite. Well, that's good to know. Other humans have spite and jealousy and that kind of stuff as well. Good to know. Humans feel less terrible now in, in comparison. Bosnians, I want to swim. In Croatia, no. <laughs> At the thinnest part there, but like furthest down south. It's like, what is that? It's like 500 meters of land just between Bosnia and the ocean. Oh my god. White dudes be like, there he is, the man, the myth, the legend. And it's just Garrett. Yeah, I've, I think I felt like this has happened a few times. It's funny because it's that kind of thing you feel happens all the time, but you can't pinpoint it. It's like, you know, oh, a friend of a friend's friend. They're like... Hey, it's Steve! The party can start! And then Steve comes in, like the most vanilla person you could ever expect. Like, hey guys, I brought this completely regular beer. And people are like, whoa! Hell yeah, Steve! What did you do today? Oh, I don't know, I woke up and then I came here. Like, wow! Champion! <laughs> Loser at the gas station. I saw some guy at the gas station that looked like a loser. You know who you are. I appreciate the commitment of actually paying money to post this in the local newspaper. That's glorious. I like how it says further down, you saw me. <laughs> Wait, is this like the dating part of the newspaper? Handsome man at the car wash, loser at the gas station. This is gorgeous. I love this. All right, everybody, listen up. I need your attention. Mm -hmm. If y'all mess with my post yeah. while it's still setting, I'm gonna eat that one. Now take that, cows, you silly rascals. Oh my god. Isn't it that old Simpson episode where they're trying to make like an anti-vegan case or something like that? And they're like, a cow would not hesitate to eat you and your entire family. And they just try to make cows out to be these demonic creatures. It's amazing. All animals want to live. Where do you draw the line? I draw the right line here. Thanks for asking, PETA. And here we go draw the line here. This dog is horrible. There we go. Absolutely beautiful. Mm, yum. Man's best friend and man's best burger. Am I right? Yes. So here we got one of those memorial Second World War and Banana Wars, 1934. Rafael Toro. What was the Banana Wars? This. Is, why does the Banana Wars have one single casualty? I have never heard. What? What are the Banana Wars? I. I am intrigued. Content warning. The following video contains discussions of and depictions of mild violence, explicit language, military, war, terrorism, mishandling of neurodivergent characters, character death, racial stereotypes, mild sexual humor, supernatural horror, and the Dutch. <gasps> oh, the hot, no! Why would someone please think of the children? Oh, look at this. It's such serene water, all the dolphins. Oh my god, look out, bank! <laughs> Dolphins are horrible creatures. I mean, they are the second most intelligent species, so I guess they're insecure about it. Take that dolphin, you little low IQ plurb. This butt fish decided to walk out of the water one day, and now I have to go to work and pay rent, you dumb fish. Ah, oh, Mayhad Bay Resort. This swimming pool was temporarily closed due to the David-19 situation. David, what did- David, what did you do? I really hope the staff of this place turned this into some kind of internal joke afterwards. Like, hey, David, not messing up the pool, are we? Most tweeters don't post things like this. We're asking tweeters to review posts with potentially false or misleading information. Want to take another look before tweeting? I'm in a really good place mentally right now. Oh. <laughs> Yay, my depression is cured. Mm, fact checkers say this is very false, you sad little shite. <gasps> they got little monkeys. They're eating the foods. My god, what a vibe. And then it's just, can you give me some of that food? Like, nah, nah, you, you stay away from my food. <laughs> Just a big happy family. Changes to their permanent houses. Tom McEldron, who asks to remain anonymous. <laughs> it's so much like, oh, I asked to remain anonymous. We obviously didn't give a shit, and we're not afraid of hiding it either. <laughs> Sometimes in life, you just come across those glorious, glorious sentences that just take you for a ride with 10 words or less. Hi, Steven. Do I have your attention now? I know all about her, you dirty, sneaky, immoral, unfaithful, poorly announced slime ball. Everything's caught on tape. Your soon-to-be ex-wife, Emily P.S. I paid for this billboard from our joint bank account. Oh, oh dear. Where did you... Did you... I'm... Did you place this, like, on his way to work or something? How would you know that he... He's, he will see this. 
Or maybe it just gets trending on the internet and everyone sees it. <laughs> Ironically, it's trending now, heck yeah. Who does it? Every evening, a pepper falls down the chimney. I worship the Lord and have never made an enemy. <laughs> Who's doing it? I hate you. Caught throwing. I have a one-of-a-kind relationship with Christ. What does that have to do with peppers? He has harmed people for me. He can find you in any town that I suggest you end your campaign. Let's talk about this and your phone number. Oh my god. So wait a second, you have a random person throwing peppers down your chimney and you're threatening with Jesus rapturing them as a response and then putting your public phone number, which editor, please censor that, thank you, um, to like semi-dox yourself. <laughs> This is so wild in every direction, I swear to God. I will never understand how people decided masks and vaccines were the defining obstacle to American freedom. And not, I don't know, the 30-hour work week, rent, college tuition, police, Ryan Seacrest, etc. <laughs> In memory of Roger Bucklesby, who hated this park and everyone in it. Mm, now you can have your memorial plate in the park forever, Roger Bucklesby. You little bitch peptic. Will you subscribe to me? Yes, no, I already am. Oh, oh, that hurts. Ouch. He has more votes than subs. Oh my god, it just gets worse. Holy shite. So here we got a little fishing crew going on. Gonna just swing the little as a. News! Man eaten by piranhas after jumping in a lake to flee from bees. <laughs> you just can't catch a break. Oh no. So you know when you're just rolling down the street and the fork says frick you and even gives you the finger when you take it into the shop. Mm, isn't that beautiful? I love the universe sometimes. Somebody's day was ruined. Alright, so we got a bus here. We got some dirty stuff. Wait a second. Is that like literally a person's shadow? in the massive dirt splash. This is like what happens in the cartoon. Is this real? Is this actually real? Oh my god. You were called yesterday. Not intentionally. Hmm? I was watching the Jets game and yelled, that was an awful freaking call. Just terrible. My phone picked up. Called just terrible. And well, that's how you're stored. Anyway, have a great day. Frick you! <laughs> At least, I mean, it could be worse. You could be, like, doing something sinful and be like, Oh, yas, daddy. And then you have daddy stored in your phone and gets called during the... Yeah, you know what I mean. It, it can be a very interesting situation for everyone involved. So you got this new pavement done, bro. Well, that's a shame. Oh my god, just gonna strut all over this. I hope you don't mind, you stupid human poo. Sorry, I'm getting very worked up about this and I, I'm kind of rooting for the rooster. Nebraska Humane Society. Stop talking trash about our local wildlife. Raccoons are resourceful. Possums are intelligent. Squirrels are good climbers. Owls are very wise. Geese. Deer are gentle. Mm, it's beautiful. Appreciate all animals. All animals. R slash ask women. Which male name has been ruined forever for you? Chris. For no real reason other than I never met an interesting Chris. Can confirm, if Chris was the spice, he'd be flower. <laughs> Is Chris the dude that other post was talking about? You know, hey, it's Chris, the man, the myth, the legend. <laughs> I think so. It must be. Chris, I'm sorry. I think you're beautiful still, okay? Flower is nice. You can bake with flower, you know? You're literally like half a cake. That That's pretty cool. Oh, it's an escaped little pony. Look at that. He's just so happy. It's free. Oh, uh... It's not even particularly violent or anything, but it's just like, oh, no, I'm gonna cross here and just casually tip over a guy on a moped. <laughs> just because. If I won Powerball, I'd buy every ticket to a Kanye West show, and when he came out, it would just be me like, Ah, you suck! <laughs> Money well spent. Literally spent the life changing amount on this. So... Worth it. Last night, while walking our dog Vista, someone drove by and used the potato gun type device to shoot two bullfrogs at my boyfriend. Both hit him and left marks. It was a white scion type vehicle, and here are pictures of the frogs, as if that's gonna, you know, prove anything more. This is so specific. This feels like a parody of a Batman villain. Ah, oh, it's Frog Cannon Man. Eh? I mean, it's basically on par with the weirdness of the, of the villains anyway, so it's not that far-fetched. Troll notice. If someone's Twitter name is something like Joe1283726635, don't waste time replying, simply block. Joe1283726635, come on, man. Making Europe a way better place. Wee. Oh, there's no France, I see. <laughs> 
Useless man now with clothing. This man contributes absolutely nothing to society. Lazy, unwashed programs in Java. <gasps> Disgusting. I mean, to be fair, Minecraft was made in Java. Minecraft is pretty cool, am I right? Minecraft is pretty lit. Am, am I right, Swag Squad? Yeah. And now we put one race in just to frick with somebody. Okay, how many of you in the comments would be open? If I started a restaurant, what do you think about pizza? Not with pineapple, but with raisins. Who would want a raisin pizza? Let me know in the comments. Oh, yes, indeed. Coca-Cola cancelled the Canadian promotion that paired randomly generated English and French words inside bottle caps after a woman got one that said, You are word. <laughs> you are word. It's... <laughs> Oh my god, if I ever got this one, I would kind of want to keep it just because it's so unique and absolutely ridiculous, but I can see why they canceled the campaign. That's not great. I'm more surprised that they just didn't add a word filter to this, you know? Like, oh, random words to just take the entire dictionary with all the swears and slurs and everything. That That's not great. No smoking! Don't speak French! <laughs> Don't do it. Documented cases of feral children, raised by primates or monkeys, raised by wolves, raised by dogs, raised by bears, raised by sheep, raised by cattle, raised by goats, raised by ostriches, raised by the French. I got a man walking down the sploosh. Oh, that sucks so bad, that's so moist, right? And then a little... When the university tells you, Oh my god, are you a little upset this spaghetti that you got splushed? Here, take a cold shower and cool down, fam. It's gonna be fine. Stupid universe. Flip inside out and hand wash cold water so you don't ruin it like everything else in your life. <laughs> when you get called that by a hat. You can't tell me how to ruin things, stupid hat. I'll destroy you if I want. Can I own a capybara in California? They are illegal to own as a bet in California. The rodents aren't dangerous, just weird looking. Is <laughs> the department the fish and game spokesman? We're gonna make this illegal. It doesn't have any implications. It's not problematic in the least. I, I just think they look a little weird. Kids playing with a water hose during Coast Guard demonstration. Psh, wee. The longer I look at this, the harder I laugh. <laughs> look, looks like he's just moonwalking midair. That's beautiful. Ah. Wow, Tim, just look at those birds flying in formation. Who cares, dude? Birds are lame. Frick you, Tim. Harry Potter hates Ohio. <laughs> Wait, who made this shirt? Is this official Harry Potter merch? Why specifically Ohio? Does Ohio even show up in the Harry Potter universe? Is Ohio real in the Harry Potter universe? <laughs> oh my god. What a serene landscape until God gives you the finger. Thank you, God. So here we got a little turtle, and as soon as you have black tape, the turtle is really insistent on just bunking the frickin' ah! And then when you just take it off, um, the turtle will instantly stop. Yep, yeah, yeah, and then it's completely calm. Doesn't mind at all. Look at that. Now this is completely chill. <sighs> Learn about racism at your local library. Attention, man! Sergeant Avon Teddy wants to remind you, if on her skin she has a doodle, never ever let her touch your noodle. <laughs> Tattoos are sure sign that woman has syphilis, mentally unsound, and possibly from Quebec or America. Health, Canada. Oh no, not Quebec. Oh dear God. Man, these like old information postcards or comics or anything, the age is so milky and soury. It's amazing. Listen up, privates. You're gonna sit still and don't stand up until I... That's right. Don't stand up. It's a free shower. Hashtag on this day in 1957, baseball player Richie Ashburn fouls and hit a fan Alice Roth twice in the same game at bat playing for the Philadelphia Phillies. The first hit breaks her nose. Second one hits her while she's on the stretcher. This reminds me of that elephant stampeding, you know, twice, but, but it's a ball. I wonder if it hit her on the nose both times as well. It hit her on the nose on the stretcher as well. That would have been horrible. Stop talking trash about different Midwest states. Minnesota is iconic. Wisconsin is beautiful. Illinois, magnificent. Michigan is great. Ohio? Iowa is cutting edge. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What did Ohio ever do? What didn't it do? I don't know. I'm not American. Can someone tell me, please? All right. Th this seems a bit wonky. Um, yeah, it's fine. Just turn your way back around. <laughs> 
yeah, we're going on this small, simple ride. It's fine, fam. And, and Courtney's gonna throw up for the rest of the day. What a trip. Wendy's old-fashioned hamburgers now hiring to replace Jacob. I suppose it's the kind of advertisement that will work very well because it gets trending on Twitter and stuff. A Colombian protester single-handedly holds back an armored water cannon truck using a homemade shield. That looks so badass. This could be an anime. Oh my god. My husband just walked in, told the dog how cute he is and how much he loves him, held his face in his hands, stared into his eyes, and gave him a forehead kiss. Then left the room. I am sitting right next to the dog. But you see, Stacy, it's priorities. When we agreed to get this dog, this was gonna be the new game for both of us. Don't, just admit it, you do the same thing when he's sitting at the couch next to the dog, and it's as it should be. My god, human love is spent. Day five of turning straight girls gay. Ah, oh, yes, ah. Oh. Hey, that's Randy's job. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Randy, no! Randy! Randy, come back, please! How about turning straight men's gay? How about that? Randy! Walter Summerfold was struck by lightning in 1918. Six years afterwards, in 1924, he was again struck by lightning. Another six years later, in 1930, he was struck by lightning again. Even after his death in 1932, lightning struck his grave in 1936. This is like when the universe wants you to turn into Thor, but it doesn't really work. <laughs> And it just keeps zapping you for no reason. When you pray to God to remove your family's problems, then the next day you find yourself in heaven. <laughs> Take that. And now you can be God's problem. Oh, Sky Daddy, I am so lonely. I will just follow you around awkwardly all day. Bet you regret bringing me here now. Oh, we got some fall guys. Oh, just gonna stand and taunt people. Hey, look. <laughs> oh, get hit by a ball. No worries. You can still make. It. You can still make it. You can still make it. You can still. You can. You can still. You can still make it. You can still. You can still make it. You can. You didn't make it. But that's karma for you. I like how they paused for like half a second to taunt people, <laughs> and then they just get raffle stomped for like a minute straight. Are you just gonna scroll past me without saying ye claw? I hate this crab so much. Yes, I am. Frick you, crab. Oh, poor crab, it has a hat. Alright, just walking down the street, just vibing. Oh god, oh, run, run, what's going on? Is it a car? Is it a... <laughs> what is that? Is it a duck? Is it a goose? The formation of the duck. How the head is poked so far. It's really an attack position. It's like a freaking ballistic missile, but a goose. Which means it's more terrifying and deadly. When the bees kill a wasp in the bee documentary. Yay! When the bees kill a wasp in the wasp documentary. Yay! <laughs> Poor little wasp. This power line happened to be laid straight through the skull of an Anglo-Saxon woman buried in a previously undiscovered 6th century graveyard. <sighs> Can you imagine having your grave completely untouched for that long just to have someone lay like an automatic pipeline to just drill it and pipe it without even properly digging you up first? Yahoo! Asshole lab rat really screwing with scientific study. Researchers at Harvard are incredibly annoyed with a lab rat they describe as a real a-hole. We're trying to research how obesity impacts brain function, explained Dr. Stu Macho. To do that, we got all these normal rats and started observing them. Then this little fricker, we call him 42, starts eating a ton. He got so super fat and starts walking into his cage wall like a moron when we try to observe him. But then, at night, he's completely normal. It's totally throwing off our data. He's being a real shite head. This isn't the first time 42 has ruined an experiment, Dr. Macho explains. I once ran an experiment to test whether the sense of cats was frightening to rats. We gave them a treat every time they pushed a big red button. Then we sprayed it with cat scent. Literally every single rat was too scared to push the red button, except 42. He pushed it, winked, and then held his little paws out for a treat. He's such an a-hole! His data screwed my entire thesis! Ladies and gentlemen, this is science in a nutshell. <laughs> You, oh my god! You should turn your study around and be like, how we discovered a hyper-intelligent fat rat instead. I would love that study. Oh my god. If you can't beat them, just join them. You could be partners in crime. I feel like this is the case as well in science in general, but it's usually people who are like this. <laughs> you can't hold hands with God when you're in Ohio. So, so you hold hands with Satan? For anyone trying to talk to me today, break was good, Christmas was good, I don't have a New Year's resolution, I'm on episode 4 of Making a Murder, so don't tell me shite, I'll level with you, Linda. I have been drunk for three weeks straight, it's the only way I can tolerate my borderline racist family. Can you do me a solid, just this once, and walk away before you open your mouth and pollute the air with mindless small talk? I am one unnecessary question away from hanging myself in the break room. Good day to you, Linda, good day! 
A wow, yeah, this, that's basically an office environment in a nutshell, isn't it? <sighs> office small talk was like the, the wildest thing. I, I distinctly remember one day when I was in the office, like a normal office person with a real job. And in one day, I got asked like, oh, what did you do on your Sunday? Like nine times before lunch. It was like, oh, nothing much. That was basically my, you know, excuse of not wanting to say, yeah, I spend my 12 hours on, on, on Sunday editing Reddit videos for YouTube. I love you. 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 Frick you. Hmm. I would prefer to have the frick you one. It has more attitude. For $5, this shelter will write the names of people you hate in the litter box. That is so good. This reminds me of that business, the custom printed toilet paper, so you could print pictures of people you hated. This is like that, but it goes to good cause. Oh, it's so beautiful. Look at those little kitties. Well, lotties, lasses, and lassos, I do hope you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed making it, and have an amazing rest of your day, because you really do deserve it. And I will see you in the very near future. Take care. Mwah. Yeah! <laughs>